So we offer full-time MVQs in level one, two and three in both hairdressing and beauty therapy. So they're full-time courses and they are each about three to three and a half days a week. We also offer part-time courses in hair and beauty, level one and level two of an evening for about three and a half hours a week. Um, you can expect to be doing a mixture of practical and theory. We do have at least two days in the salon. All our students perform treatments. Obviously, when they're initially learning them, they practice on each other just to help build their confidence and to get their skills as they should be. But once it comes to practical assessments, they actually are done on commercial clients. We run a commercial salon here. We have clients coming in from the local community every day of the week. On beauty therapy level two, you're looking at treatments such as facials, eyelash tinting, false lashes, manicures, pedicures, waxing. So there's lots of different treatments you do there. If you then decide to move on to the level three qualification, we're looking at spa therapy there. So you're doing treatments such as body massage, body wraps, use of the sauna and steam room, the jacuzzi, which we have in one of our salons here. So it's a very interactive course. Um, we do obviously have to do some theory as well, really important so that we know what we're doing. Um, but we try and make that as interesting interesting and as relevant to what we're doing as possible. So you get a good all-round course really. I've spoken to previous students who have qualified doing this course and she recommended this college to me. Yeah, it's a really good college. I like the fact that it's real clients coming into the college so it gives off a professional image straight away, you know. So when you do go out in the workplace you already know how to deal with clients. As well as the main qualification, we try and put on a lot of varied courses and trips just to try and keep up with things that are on trend in the industry. Um, we've put on a lot of courses this year, such as the Minx Nails, which has been very popular. The Gel Polish is very popular, we do that as well. Um, things like intimate waxing. We tend to go to trade shows so that the students can get to see what's new and up and coming in the industry. We also do a lot, of, a lot of competitions as well, both nationally and within the college. I know that one of our students actually came first in the regional heats of Beauty UK last year. I've always been interested in um, doing beauty therapy since I left school really. I think this is a very good college. Uh, the tutors are very supportive, they help you in everything that you do. Um, I was entered into a few competitions, I came first place in those. Um, I've been entered into them again for this year. We have um, two salons within the beauty department. We've got this salon, which is more of the beauty level two salon. And then we've got a larger salon where the students do more of the spa therapies. In that salon, we have got um, a sauna and a steam room as well. Um, we also tend to take the level three spa therapy students out to a local spa and they'll go and use the flotation tanks. They'll learn how to use all the spa facilities so that when they go out into industry, they are prepared for what they will actually have to do. Basically, we want our students to go out there and get the jobs. You know, there's a lot of competition in the beauty industry, but we want people to go out there, get the top jobs, get where they want to be. So as a college, we're here to support them, but we do expect them to work hard. We're very tight in attendance. We're also very tight on punctuality, because in the job we do, really important. You can't keep your clients waiting. You can't let them down. We really try and instill teamwork within our students. We're all here to support them, to get them through the qualification, and we want them to do their best and to go on to bigger and better things.